They all lived happily together, but one day, hunters took their dad away. Forever. So now the brothers were alone, and they had to find a new home. They started a journey through the great big forest. The wolf brothers wandered for days and nights, learning how to live on their own for the first time. They slept in the backwoods among creepy creatures and barely ate anything. They eventually found a peaceful orchard and were able to eat in peace. But they didn't know. Hunters tried to tie them up, but the wolf brothers managed to escape with the help of a friendly bear. He showed them how to survive and helped them find a warm camp for the night. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. That's how they found themselves even further, headed to the faraway land of their pop, where they hoped to find peace. It was too heavy for you a few days ago. Let's try to lift something else. Not too heavy, though. I'm a little tired. I'm so glad Daniel took this little girl with us. I'm so glad Daniel took this little girl with us. You could try and lift mushroom? Are you kidding? I don't want to hurt her. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're probably right. Let's leave the puppy out of this. How about those cans? Can you fly them all together without dropping any? Sure, look. That's awesome, dude. You're getting way better at this. Okay. Let's show Daniel some more stuff to play with before we call it a day. How about trying out that rock over there? Just one more time. We already tried yesterday. And the day before. It's too far. I can't reach it. Just... One more time. So close. I can feel it. How about that one? I can do it with the small rods, but not the big ones. You can do this. Trust me. Just relax. Focus. I'll try.
Holy shit. I did it. <laughs> like a boss. You're getting good at you this. You see that mushroom? That was the biggest rock ever. Come on, dude. That's just the start. Let's try something else. Cool. You're like Coach Aaron. You're my power coach. A snowball fight? Not yet. This is a new exercise, young apprentice. See if you can stop this in the air. Cool? Okay, but you better not hit me. Like that time you gave me a bruise? Serious. You won't let me, right? Try it. Sean! <gasps> you suck! I said, don't hit me, jerk. Sorry, I thought you would stop it. Serious. Think fast. Stop. Whoa, Daniel. That's what you get. Happy. Hell yeah, I am. That was awesome. You did it, man. I did. So you better be nice to me. <coughs> hey, that still sounds nasty. <coughs> You're not getting better. I told you. I'm fine. Just a little beat. Well, you need to rest now. Superhero. Can we go back now? Yeah. Let's just fill up the canteens before we head back. That cough has been going on for days, Daniel. I really don't like that. I told you. I'm fine. You've just been outside for a while. The family who owned that cabin really seemed to enjoy themselves here. Why never come back? <sighs> we really nailed it with this two-headed snow ogre. Yeah, they're really badass. And Musher- <laughs> Daniel's definition of a cool snowman. I like it. Uh, Sean? The family that lived here, what do you think happened to them? They must have moved out. Maybe to another state. But they left all their stuff behind? I don't know, man. Maybe they live in Florida and only come here every 10 years. Maybe they got... You can't really name birds, right? Probably the name of a child who used to live here. Maybe they got tired of these woods. Well, I'm glad they left. This is our lair now. I just... I miss my friends. And my room. Yeah. Not my kind of weeds. Some... Yeah. Me too. <sighs> Must have been a really sweet spot to get a tan in the summer. What? What did you find, Shroom? Gotta leave these poor bunnies alone. Okay. Let's find water and then get inside. It's freaking cold out here. Look, Daniel! I think I saw that rabbit from the other day. He's trying to get home. Ooh! I wanna see the bunny! <laughs> oh, dude, your face. Sean, you suck. <laughs> Come on, Daniel. I was just kidding around. Moron. <sighs> Finally.
Finding that house was a miracle. But I'm afraid we can't stay here much longer. Are you getting hungry? Not really. Really? I'm getting hungry. We tried to fish in the river. But we really sucked. Again, you eat like a bear, but you don't gain any weight. That's because I work it off. We had to use Daniel's oh, gift to break. We need our fresh water before we go back inside. Oh, still no catch? Ah, oh, cool. Dude, come on. Let's find those canteens and fill them up so we can go inside. Here we go. The Hella Tanker is over the wildfire zone. Get ready for water extraction. Ranger Diaz. Lazy Ranger, I told you not to bust out your power whenever- Sean, the water's fucking cold. Uh, oops. Sorry. I said fucking. Yeah, dude. Watch it. Seriously. Okay. We really suck at this trap thing. I miss Dad's barbecues. His marinade with the aciote paste, jalapenos. Shit. Don't worry, we'll make a fire. We're pros now. <coughs> Dude, that cough doesn't sound too good. Nah, uh, I'm okay. Just cold. You kicked ass today. Level up. I did. That was so cool. It's getting easier every day. Oh no, Sean. This is a haunted house. More like, uh-oh, it's time to go over the rules. I told you about showing off. I was just... Whatever. Dude, I know the rules. Let's find out. What's the first one? Uh, uh, Hide your power. If you spin one plate in a diner, what happens? People will freak out. And when people freak, what do they do? They call the cops. Exactly. The second rule is... Don't, uh... Never talk about it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice, Daniel. Because that's usually the hardest rule for you. <sighs> Shut up. <laughs> and the final rule? I know... Come on. Um... You can do it. Okay. Um... Avoid danger? Run from danger. This is the most important one. You know why? Uh, I don't know. I mean, with my power, I can help us. Only as a total last resort. How will I know that? If there's any other way of helping, do that first. Maybe if I had used it before, 
Dad might still be here. Daniel, you didn't even know. That shit was out of your control. But look what happened to the policeman. Maybe this power is a curse or something. Hey, we have no clue what happened. And it's not your fault. <coughs> Don't worry, Mushroom. I'm okay. Good puppy. <sighs> she must be hungry. What about you? I'm always hungry. <laughs> then let's grub out. I'll make us some dinner. <laughs> yeah. Before she eats us. <laughs> I hate it when I hear Daniel crying at night. Can't do shit. Kinda weird to use stranger stuff every day, but not like we have a choice. Mecha robot. Tanya must have been pissed that day. Don't blame him. Poor guy. I guess kids have to grow up anyway, right? I wish I helped Dad more with the house chores back then. Wish I had more than tobacco, to be honest. There was a little bit left when we came. Pretty disgusting, but helped staying warm. We're so lucky this thing is still working. Wouldn't have lasted long without heat. HQ, I'm flying over the city. No danger. <sighs> Shit. Where did I put my lighter? He's definitely a fast learner. <sighs> Maybe too fast. We scored with these clothes. Plus five street cred. Mushroom clung to Daniel on the first nights. But now she loves her bed by the fire. Thank God kids used to spend vacations here. Daniel would have been mad without these. Daniel needs a doggo friend. High school feels so far away now. This thing is strong as a rock.
Thanks, Hank. Dickhead. I can't believe how much Daniel's powers have improved over the last weeks. Feels almost good to be cut off from everything. This room is fucking cold, so we put everything we didn't need in it and keep it closed. I wonder how far it can go. Hello, motel room soap. No way I can give any of these to Daniel. <sighs> Too risky. This is rank. Sharing with Daniel was the worst. We really lucked out stumbling into this house. <sighs> no more peeing at night for Daniel. He got so scared. We're lucky he didn't blow up the house. This is rank. <sighs> Sharing with Daniel was the worst. At least we have fresh water in our front yard. Hey, I put some clean water in the bathroom so you can wash a little. It feels weird to loot other people's clothes, but we need the warmth. Once you get used to squatting, it's not so bad. We never found the key to this door. I guess using the sliding door is cool. Daniel's cold is getting worse. We need a serious fire in here. Hey, Shroom. You thirsty? <laughs> Good girl. I think I could get used to living like this. Quiet, free. Last night, I used my lighter for the candles, so it shouldn't be far. Let's go 
GoPro. We're freezing in here. Time to get warm. Here we go. Hold on, Mushroom. We're gonna build a fire. Starving. Guess it's time to start cooking. Yum. Too bad I can't make a pizza fly to us. I could start Daniel's delivery service. This hot dog man issue is kind of weird. This house is cool, but he looks so <laughs> serious on this picture. I still can't believe he's gone. I miss him so much, it hurts, Sean. I know, Daniel. It's okay to think of- I hate it when I hear Daniel crying at night. I know, Daniel. It's okay to think about him. I do it too. Okay. Thanks, Sean. <laughs> Dude! You'll be moving cars around in no time if you keep improving like that. Mm, you really think so? Well, that'd be a bad idea, but you sure are getting good at this. I wonder if there's anyone else like me. Mm, I think we'd know it by now. 